Good afternoon, and welcome to Congregation Emmanuel's Daily Sunset Service. I'm Rabbi Stephen Franklin. I'm the retired rabbi of Riverdale Temple in Riverdale and a member of Temple Emmanuel, and I will be our reader for today. Our sunset service follows the Union Prayer Book, the familiar small blue volume, and if you don't have a copy at hand, you can view and print the selections you will need to follow the readings and the responsive readings as well. That part is only 13 pages and it is found on the temple's website, emmanuelnyc.org, emmanuelnyc.org. Click the link that says Daily Prayer Book PDF. Let's take time from the fears and concerns in these dangerous times for quiet reflection and prayer. It's in these special moments that we have the chance to rediscover who we are and where we are going, where we are going in life. The service will begin now on page 280, page 280. Hinei barfu et Adonai, kol avdei Adonai ha'umdim bevet Adonai balelot. Su'u yedeichem kodesh uvarchu et Adonai. Yevarecha ha'adonai mitzion ose shamayim va'aretz. Yomam yitzave Adonai chasto uvalayla shiro imi. Kuli el Adonai ekra. Bless ye the Lord, all ye servants of the Lord that stand in the house of the Lord in the night seasons. Lift up your hands unto the Lord and worship him in holiness. The Lord who made heaven and earth will bless thee out of Zion. By day the Lord will command his loving kindness and in the night his song shall be with me. I will call unto the Lord with my voice, and he answereth me out of his holy mountain. But as for me, in thy mercy do I trust. My heart shall rejoice in thy salvation. I will sing unto the Lord, because he hath dealt bountifully with me. Ashir al Adonai, ki gamal alai. Page 281, we read responsively. The heavens declare the glory of God and the firmament showeth his handiwork. Day unto day uttereth speech, night unto night revealeth knowledge. There is no speech, there are no words, neither is their voice heard. Their line is gone out through all the earth and their words to the ends of the world. The law of the Lord is perfect, restoring the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure, making wise the simple. The precepts of the Lord are right, rejoicing the heart. The commandment of the Lord is pure, enlightening the eyes. The fear of the Lord is clean, enduring forever. The ordinances of the, of the ordinances of the Lord are true. They are righteous altogether. More to be desired are they than gold, yea, that much fine gold, sweeter also than honey and the honeycomb. Moreover, by them is thy servant warned. In keeping of them, there is great reward. Who can discern errors? Clear thou me from hidden faults. Keep back thy servant also from presumptuous sins, that they may not have dominion over me. Then shall I be faultless, and I shall be clear, I shall be clear from great transgression. Let the words of my mouth 
and the meditation of my heart be acceptable before thee, O Lord, my rock and my redeemer. We turn now to page 288 and 289. Those of you who wish, you may rise, although on a video service, it's a little bit awkward. We're going to say you don't have to rise at a point like this. The call to worship, Baruch Hu. Baruch Hu et Adonai HaMevorach. Baruch Adonai HaMevorach Leolam Vahed. Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam. אשר בדברו מעריב ערבים, בחוכמה פותח שערים, ובתבונה משנה עיתים, ומחליף את הזמנים, ומסדר את הכוכבים במשמרותיהם ברקיע כרצונו, בורא יום ולילה אדוני צבאות שמו. ירחי וקיים תמיד ימלוך עלינו לעולם ועד, ברוך אתה אדוני המעריב ערבים. We continue together in the English. Infinite as is thy power, even so is thy love. Thou didst manifest it through Israel, thy people. By laws and commandments, by statutes and ordinances, hast thou led us in the way of righteousness and brought us to the light of truth. Therefore, in our lying down and our rising up, we will meditate on thy teachings and find in thy laws true life and length of days. Oh, that thy love may never depart from our hearts. Praised be thou, O Lord, who hast revealed thy love through Israel. Call to worship completed. We turn now to the watchword of our faith, the Shema. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad. Baruch Shem, Kevod Mahalchuto, Li Olam Vahed. V'yahavta et Adonai Echad. בכל לבבך ובכל נפשך ובכל מיודך והיו הדברים האלה אשר נוחי מצבך היום על לבביך ושיננת העם לבניך ודיברת בם בשבתך בביתך ובלכתך בדרך ובשוכבך ובקומך וקשרתם להיות על ידיך, והיו לתותפות בין עיניך, וכתבתם על מזוזות ביתך ובשעריך. למען תזכרו ועשיתם את כל מצוותי, והייתם קדושים לאלוהיכם. אני אדוני אלוהיכם. אמת ואמונה כל זאת וקיים עלינו, כי הוא אדוני אלוהינו ואין זולתו ואנחנו ישראל עמו. Eternal truth it is that thou alone art God and there is none else. And through thy power alone has Israel been redeemed from the hand of oppressors. Great deeds hast thou wrought in our behalf and wonders without number. Thou hast kept us in life. Our footsteps have not faltered. Thy love has watched over us in the night of oppression. Thy mercy has sustained us in the hour of trial. And now that we live in a land of freedom, may we continue to be faithful to thee and thy word. May thy law rule the life of all thy children and thy truth unite them in hearts and fellowship. O God, our refuge and our hope, we glorify thy name now as did our fathers in ancient days. 
מי כמוך בהילים אדוני, מי כמוך נהדר בקודש. נורת הילות עושה פלא, נורת הילות עושה פלא. מלכותך ראו בניך, זה אלי אנו ויאמרו. אדוני ימלוך, אדוני ימלוך, לעולם ועד. נאמר כי פדה אדוני את יעקב וגלו ביד חזק ממנו, ברוך אתה אדוני, גל ישראל. Is thou hast redeemed Israel and saved us from arms stronger than our own, so mayest thou redeem all who are oppressed and persecuted. Praise be thou, O Lord, Redeemer of Israel. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu Belohe avoteinu v'imoteinu אלוהי אברהם, אלוהי יצחק, ואלוהי יעקב, האל הגדול, הגיבור והנורא, אל עליון, גומל חסדים טובים, וקונאי הכל, וזוכה חסדי אבות ואימהות, ומביא גאולה לבני בניהם, למען שמור באהבה, מלך עוזר. ומושיע ומגן, ברוך אתה אדוני, מגן אברהם ועזרת שרה. Eternal is thy power, O Lord, thou art mighty to save. In loving kindness thou sustainest for living. In the multitude of thy mercies thou preservest all. Thou upholdest the falling, healest the sick, bringest freedom to the captives and keepest faith with thy children in death as in life. Who is like unto thee, Almighty God, author of life and death, source of salvation? Praised be thou, O Lord, who hast implanted within us immortal life. Heavenly Father, who graciously bestowest knowledge on humankind and endowest us with reason. Send us the light of thy truth that we may gain an ever clearer insight into the wisdom of thy ways. Banish from our hearts every desire and thought of evil that we may truly revere thy holy name, forgive our sins, pardon our failings, and remove from us suffering and sorrow May the erring and the way would be led to know thy loving kindness and to serve thee in newness of heart. And may those who love virtue and do the right ever be glad of thy favor. Bless our land with plenty and our nation with peace. May righteousness dwell in our midst and virtue reign among us. O thou who knowest our deeds before we utter them and ordainest all things for the best, in thee do we forever put our trust. And let us say together, Amen. Tfilah vidmama, silent meditation. Pray now if you wish using the words printed on page 299 or any other words which your hearts might prompt in the silence.
words printed on the page asking God to save us from pestilence surely, surely have a particular poignancy in this time of the COVID-19 virus. May the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable before thee, O Lord, my rock and my redeemer. Amen. And now we think of those we love, those we know who are ill at this time. As we offer up our, our prayer for healing, for Mishabera prayer, if you have names that you wish to include in the prayer, mention them out loud now before we utter the words of the prayer itself. Mi shebeirach avoteinu mekor habracha lehimoteinu May the source of strength who blessed the ones before us help us find the courage to make our lives a blessing and let us say Amen. Mi shebeirach imoteinu mekor habracha liyavoteinu Bless those in need of healing with refuah lehima. The renewal of body, the renewal of spirit, and let us say, ah, ah, Amen. Dear friends, worship is conducted by Temple Emmanuel each day of the year on the holy days and festivals according to their times and seasons. On Shabbat, Friday evenings at 6 o'clock p.m. and Saturday mornings at 10.30. While the temple building is closed during the COVID-19 shutdown, all our services are being live streamed and are accessible from the temple's website, emmanuelnyc.org, and the temple's Facebook page. This sunset service is conducted by a panel of readers under the auspices of the, of the Temple's Men's Club. Temple Emmanuel is a house of prayer for all peoples and all who would worship with us in peace are always most welcome. We turn now to page 71 in the prayer book, page 71 for the Alenu, the Adoration. Let us adore the ever-living God and render praise unto him who spread out the heavens and established the earth whose glory is revealed in the heavens above and whose greatness is manifest throughout the world. He is our God. There is none else. We bow the head in reverence and worship the King of Kings, the Holy One. Praised be he. 
ואנחנו קוראים ומשתחווים ומודים לפני מלך מלכי המלכים הקדוש ברוך הוא. May the time not be distant, O God, when thy name shall be worshipped in all the earth, when unbelief shall disappear, and error be no more. Fervently we pray that the day may come, when all shall invoke thy name, when corruption and evil shall give way to purity and goodness, when superstition shall no longer enslave the mind, nor idolatry blind the eye, when all who dwell on earth shall know that to thee alone every knee must bend and every tongue give homage. O may all created in thine image recognize that they are brethren, so that one in spirit and one in fellowship they may be forever united before thee. Then shall thy kingdom be established on earth, and the word of thine ancient seer be fulfilled. The Lord will reign forever and ever. Bayom hahu, bayom hahu, yihye Adonai echad, u'shemahu. On that day, the Lord shall be one, and his name shall be one. All you who mourn the loss of loved ones, and at this hour, remember the sweet companionship and the cherished hopes that have passed away with them. Give ear to the word of comfort spoken in the name of God. Only the body has died and has been laid in the dust. The spirit lives in the shelter of God's love and, and mercy. Our loved ones continue also in the remembrance of those to whom they were precious. Their deeds of loving kindness the true and beautiful words they spoke are treasured up as incentives to conduct by which the living honor the dead. And when we ask in our grief, whence shall come our help and our comfort, then in the strength of faith, let us answer with the psalmist, my help cometh from God, he will not forsake us nor leave us in our grief. Upon him we cast our burden and he will grant us strength according to the days he has apportioned to us. All life comes from him. Our, our souls are in his keeping. Come then and in the midst of sympathizing fellow worshipers let us hallow the name of God with the recitation of the Kaddish. The departed whom we now remember, according to the archives of the congregation for this day, Paul Black, Esther Ditzel, Leon Seiden, and Arlene Anderson Roden. They still live on earth in the acts of goodness they perform and in the hearts of those who cherish their memory. May the beauty of their life abide among us as a loving benediction. Indeed, as we rise to recite the Kaddish on page 77, the transliteration on page 78, Kaddish. Yitkadal v'yitkadash amirabah, 
ויאלמד יברך ירותי וימליך מלכותי, וחיי חון וביומי חון, ובחיי דכל בית ישראל, בעגלה ובזמן קריב ואמרו אמן. יהי שמי רבה מברך לי עלם ולעלמי עלמיה. יתברך וישתבח, ויתפאר ויתרומם ויתנשא, ויתהדר ויתעלה ויתהלל שמי דקודשה ברכו, לאלה מן כל ברכתה ושירתה, תוש ברכתה ונחמתה דאמירן ביעלמה ויאמרו אמן. יהי שלמה רבה מן שמיה וחיים עלינו ועל כל ישראל, ויאמרו אמן. עושה שלום במרומיו, הוא יעשה שלום עלינו, ועל כל ישראל, ויאמרו אמן. May the source of peace send peace to all of you who mourn and comfort all the bereaved among us. And let us say, Amen. And now here we part our final benediction. Yevarecha Adonai Beishmerecha. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord cause the light of the divine face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May the eternal lift up the divine face upon you and grant you peace. Can you get on? So may it be God's will. Amen and good evening, everyone.